So this is a haul. I bought this little biscuit uh, container. The, what is it called? A uh, teapot came from Royal Dalton about 25 years ago. And then this other little biscuit container. And then below it was this um, napkin holder. I've got some cloth napkins, but they're not checkerboard. And then I've got the creamer and the sugar. And those five pieces, the one, two, three, four, five, um, two of them were a dollar each. The large biscuit container was five dollars and the other was uh, two dollars and um, the napkin holder was a dollar. So that's three, eight, I think ten dollars for all all the five pieces. And then I've got the um, Mackenzie Child's tea kettle that costs substantially more. And I've got the ginger jar, which I don't know if you can tell exactly how large it is, but it's pretty big. It's pretty big. And uh, this week I found Peter Rabbit towels on sale and bought those um, because Peter Rabbit is not just Easter. Peter Rabbit is year-round. And I love Beatrix Potter. And I love those books. But, you know, $10 for things that go with my Mackenzie Childs things. And I'm real pleased with them because I didn't have to pay $100 or $50 for each little piece. And it goes quite well. And <clears throat> I can have tea. The only thing is, is I don't have cups that have the blue and white checkerboard, or do I? I might be bringing some cups in that I bought that are Christmas cups, but they have the blue and white checkerboard. And I also got this piece right here. I've got a huge uh, table covered in things, but this is from Dansk and it's made in Portugal and it has a tray with it and so I just need to wash all of this. I also bought this basket. It was not on sale but I got it at Goodwill so it was pretty cheap. And all right, so you're going to see bird food and loads and loads of seeds. And then I've gotten cards from Jerry Landers because Jerry Landers has this beautiful vlog. And I just love it. I li like looking at it because it's so imaginative. And I love Raggedy Ann dolls because, well, I know Mother's Day is coming up, but if any of my children had lived, I would have had Raggedy Ann as, as the um, um, decoration in their children's room. I like this card quite a bit because it's got the rabbit and the peacock and the pe peacock is so beautiful. Um, it's not brilliant but it's um, muted and it's it's very tasteful and pretty and I probably will frame these. I probably will not mail them to anybody. They're not that expensive. It's just that I really like them and I'm not sending postcards to anybody or letters to anybody anymore. But Pippity Tremble and the Cunning Green Stranger. Yes, and I think the Green Stranger is uh, Mr. Walking Stick. And I haven't read it yet, but this is Hop Along Jack and the Blue Bunnies. And those are grayish looking, but they're blue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven bunnies on this page that I can count. I bet I'm missing some. And on the back, there's a big bunny. It reminds me of Harvey from Jimmy Stewart's movie. But I got this book brand new from Jerry Landers. She's got a website. And then I've got a print that I need to um, 
a print that I need to frame, and the reason I got it is because Bob and I are getting older. We're in our 60s now, and these baskets are very much um, something that I've got around the house and have had for ages because of, well, I don't make them, but um, I have yarn in them. The cat doesn't get into our baskets at all, but anyway, I, I really like this because Bob and I are getting older. And this is really quite colorful. Bushki, Bushy Bottom. The Journey of Bushki, Bushy Bottom. And it has cherry or rose hip. I think those are cherries. And um, blackberries, maybe raspberries. Yeah. So I like children's books because I took a children's book course and um, it's got a Moonbeam Children's Book Award. And what's funny about that is this year we bought um, Moonstone or Moonbeam um, Pear Tree. And so that's really interesting that, and I love moon, the moon, so Anyway, I, I can't read, I can't wait till I read these, but Bob told me I had a big package on my computer, so I finally opened it and found these beautiful books, and they're signed by the author, and they're new, never been in the bathroom. Um, you know, when you buy a used book, you don't know if it's been in the bathroom. Now, maybe somebody read the